the flow kick the flow kick the kick the kick the flow kick the flow kick the flow from the government so swings and roundabouts it was worth it in the end exactly like a, a typical night out in Chelmsford where I live is probably about 150 pounds good lord so what are you eating so two, two nights two nights out is 300 quid by having a house party how old are you if you don't mind me asking I'm if you wanted to go to a house party this weekend how hard would it be for you to find one um continue on Gosford Road for half a mile messages. And, and do you reckon the £800 fine? I don't think, for the record, this 500 quid payout is going to happen, but I could be wrong. It, it has been yeah, done in the past. But has the, eight, has the £800 threat made any difference at all to your mate's plans? Um, not to my plans in particular. I'm very... No, I know. That's why I said your mates, the people you'd be sending the text messages to. Um, it's not so even funny because the other said this is one, the yellow one, it's all thin. You know I mean. We're getting pinned down in the technicalities Someone's here. The people that are having parties, do you think the £800 threat is going to have any deterrent effect on them? Um, not uh, 70% of the people that are already having them, to be honest. And not first time round. They'll have to wait until some people actually get slapped with one, and then next time round, next weekend or next party, they'll think, mm -hmm. do you know what, actually Joshua got hit with an eight. Not you, Joshua. The other Joshua got here. Keith got here with an 800 quid fine last week, and I think I'll stay at home and watch. Um, what's on at the weekends at the moment? What, what is the stay at home program? That new thing, it's a sin, looks good. You seen that on Channel 4? Tell you what, we love absolutely love Death in Paradise. One of the best things on telly, and, and Ralph Little, who I am delighted to say is a pal of mine, is knocking it out of the park at the moment on that. If you haven't watched it, you've got three you can watch on Catch Up from the new series. Half past 12 is the time. Tim Humphrey is here with your headlines. The government says no decision has been reached about giving a £500 payment to people in England who test positive for coronavirus. The plan, which would cost nearly £500 million, is seen as a way of encouraging people to stick to self-isolation rules. Police have broken up a wedding attended by 400 guests in North London. Windows have been covered at the school in Stamford Hill to stop people from seeing in. The organisers are facing a fine of £10,000. John Lewis says it will repay its £300 million coronavirus loan from the government ahead of schedule. The retailer had been expected to return the money by the middle of March, but says Christmas and Black Friday sales were better than expected. The weather, some snow showers inland in the north and on hills in central parts, otherwise dry with some sunshine and a high of seven. This is LBC. Someone on your street at your supermarket or in your park is highly likely to have COVID-19. This is a national health emergency. Around one in three people have no symptoms and are spreading it without knowing. So it's critical we stay home. Don't meet anyone outside your household or support bubble, except for exercise. Only go out if it's essential. Stop the spread. Stick to the rules. If you bend the rules, people will die. Stay home. Protect the NHS. Save lives. For the latest travel news, go to lbc.co.uk. Check in with those you care about and create a smile when they need it the most. With Zing Flowers. Amazing every time. In 50 yards, in the roundabout, take the first exit and stay on Yeah, £30 minimum spend, app only.
only. Geo restrictions and T's and C's apply. Introducing Poker Stars Casino. Bright lights, high pulses, hearts racing, wheels spinning. In. The roulette ball clicks and comes to a stop on the date of your mother's birth. Award winning Poker Stars Casino. Infinite outcomes. One thing to say.